I was hopeless. I was, I just panicked. Painful memories for family after a pit bull attacked their dog at the Virginia Beach oceanfront. That is our top story this Tuesday night. Thanks for staying up. I'm Nicole Livis. And I'm David Allen. It was then at the beach that turned tragic for a Newport News family. We told you about this story. A pit bull, Malta Yorkie named King, steps away from the Neptune statue. King didn't make it. The family had to say goodbye right there on the beach. Tonight they're talking to 13 News Now. They are sharing with us what happened the moment of the attack. Chinu Her starts us off tonight. I received King as a gift um, when he was only four weeks old. From just four weeks old, Nikita Young raised King, her Yorkie Shih Tzu mix. He taught him to be so lovable and very smart. Uh, come and knock at the door when he want to come in. Nikita and her kids considered King a member of their family. So when they headed out to Virginia Beach over Memorial Day weekend, they took him to the oceanfront with them. King stopped and played with one of the ladies that was renting out beach chairs. He ended up sniffing and playing with another dog out there. There's some of him. One second, King was playing around, and the next second, Nikita was screaming for help. That's him again. I seen a great pit bull just running towards us and swooped him up right in his mouth. Um, I had no time to grab King and all I had left was King's leash just dangling from my hand. Virginia Beach police say King was leashed on the beach and a pit bull off leash attacked and killed him. This is the video of me actually picking him up and retrieving him. Nikita says this video someone shot of her picking up King's lifeless body shows exactly how she felt. I, I wanted to save my dog like I wish I could do more to save him but I couldn't, and I just felt so hopeless, like I had to pick up one of my children off of that beach. As she reflects on that day, Nikita wishes she would have known about the restrictions for dogs at the oceanfront, or she would have never brought King to the beach. Now she hopes officials make more of an effort to bring awareness to the rules. Broadcast it on the news, radio stations, have bigger signs posted, because out of that thousand, I, I would say about a thousand people out there in that crowd, I did not see one sign. All that, so this won't happen again. And I do anything to get him back. Okay, Chinu, so what happened to the woman who was arrested in this case? Yeah, so that woman's name is Kristen Foster, and she was arrested for public intoxication, and police did tell us more charges are pending. Now, Animal Control says Foster actually is not the owner of that pit bull. She actually was just watching the dog mm. uh, for the day, but that dog right now is in Animal Control's custody. Chinu, thank you. Yeah. Well, here's the bottom line. Dogs leashed or not aren't allowed on resort area beaches until after Labor Day. You can walk a dog on a leash on the boardwalk, but from only 6 to 10 in the morning.